The Common Technical Document, or CTD, is a standardized format for drug applications used by health authorities worldwide. Before the CTD every country had its own format, making global drug approval slow and complicated. The CTD was created by the International Council for Harmonization to harmonize and simplify submissions. Now, companies can prepare one application for multiple countries, saving time and effort. The CTD organizes all required information, quality, safety, and efficacy, into a clear structure. This structure helps regulators quickly find and review the data they need. The CTD doesn't change what information is needed, just how it's organized. Think of it as a universal blueprint for building a house. Everyone follows the same plan, making inspections easier and safer. This standardization speeds up the review process and helps new medicines reach patients faster. The CTD's logical format is now the backbone of global pharmaceutical submissions. Its main strength is making drug approval more efficient and predictable. The CTD is divided into five modules, each with a specific purpose. Module 1 is region-specific containing administrative and prescribing information unique to each country. Module 2 provides summaries, an executive overview of the entire application guiding reviewers through the details. Module 3 covers quality, detailing the drug's chemistry, manufacturing and controls to ensure consistency and safety. Module 4 contains non-clinical study reports, data from animal and lab studies that assess safety before human trials. Module 5 holds clinical study reports, presenting evidence from human trials on the drug's safety and effectiveness. This modular structure streamlines the review process for regulators. Summaries in Module 2 help reviewers navigate the complex data in later modules. Quality, non-clinical and clinical data are clearly separated, making evaluation more efficient. The five-module system is the foundation of the CTD's effectiveness. It ensures every critical aspect of a new drug is thoroughly documented and easy to find. The Electronic Common Technical Document, or ECTD, is the digital evolution of the CTD. Instead of paper binders, companies submit organized electronic files using the same five-module structure. ECTD is now the standard and often mandatory format in major regions like the US, Europe, and Japan. Its main advantage is efficiency. Reviewers can instantly navigate huge submissions using hyperlinks. Lifecycle management is easier updates and changes are tracked electronically, creating a complete product history security and logistics are improved with submissions sent securely online, instead of shipping paper. The ECTD includes an index file acting as an electronic table of contents for seamless navigation. This digital format saves time, reduces errors and streamlines the entire review process. ECTD has become essential for modern pharmaceutical submissions. The biggest difference between CTD and ECTD is format, paper versus digital. Paper CTDs require printing, shipping, and storing massive binders, while ECTDs are organized PDF and XML files. ECTD is more environmentally friendly and eliminates the hassle of physical documents. Navigation is transformed. Paper CTDs require manual searching, but ECTDs use hyperlinks for instant access. Multiple reviewers can access an ECTD at once, speeding up the review process. Updates are easier. No more swapping paper pages. ECTD tracks changes automatically. The ECTD keeps a complete, accessible history of all submissions and updates. This digital approach reduces errors and ensures everyone is working with the latest information. The shift from CTD to ECTD marks a move to a faster, more reliable, and collaborative review process. For companies and regulators, ECTD is now the gold standard. The result, quicker approvals and better access to new medicines. Adoption of CTD and ECTD is growing worldwide with electronic submissions becoming the norm. In the US, the FDA requires ECTD for most drug applications. Paper is no longer accepted. Europe's EMA also mandates ECTD for centralized applications, streamlining reviews across the EU. Japan, a founding ICH member, has embraced ECTD, aligning its requirements with global standards. Other regions like India and the Gulf countries are moving toward CTD and gradually adopting ECTD. Each country may have unique requirements for Module 1 but the core CTD structure remains consistent. Regulatory professionals must always check the latest rules for each market. The global trend is clear. ECTD is becoming essential for pharmaceutical submissions. Staying updated on regional requirements is crucial for successful applications.
In summary, the CTD created a harmonized five-module structure for drug applications worldwide. The ECTD transformed this structure into a digital, efficient, and collaborative format. Key benefits include easy navigation, simultaneous review, and streamlined lifecycle management. ECTD is now mandatory in major markets, making it a must-know for regulatory professionals. The shift from paper to digital has revolutionized drug approval. Here's a practical tip. Always plan your submission with the ECTD structure in mind from the start. Organize documents clearly, use standardized file names, and create high-quality searchable PDFs. This proactive approach saves time and reduces errors when compiling your final submission. Being ECTD ready from day one makes the process smoother and more efficient. Mastering ECTD is key to a successful career in regulatory affairs.